Difference between kite and rhombus. Kites and rhombuses may look similar at first glance, but they are actually two different shapes with distinct properties. In this vlog, we will break down the differences between these two shapes and how to tell them apart. First, let's start with the basics of each shape. A kite is a quadrilateral with two pairs of adjacent sides that are equal in length. It also has one pair of opposite angels that are equal in measure. On the other hand, a rhombus is a quadrilateral with all four sides of equal length and opposite angels that are equal in measure. One of the most noticeable differences between a kite and a rhombus is their symmetry. A rhombus is symmetrical along both of its diagonals, which means that if you draw a line from one corner to the opposite corner, it will bisect the other two corners. A kite, on the other hand, has only one line of symmetry, which is the line that connects the midpoint of its shorter diagonal to the midpoint of its longer diagonal. Another difference between kites and rhombuses is the relationship between their angels. In a kite, the two non-adjacent angels are equal in measure while the other two angels are also equal in measure but are different from the first two. In a rhombus, all four angels are equal in measure. This means that if you know the measure of one angle in a rhombus, you automatically know the measure of all four angels. Finally, kites and rhombuses have different properties when it comes to their diagonals. In a kite, the longer diagonal is perpendicular to the shorter diagonal and the two diagonals intersect at a 90 degree angle. In a rhombus, the diagonals are also perpendicular, but they bisect each other at their midpoints. This means that the diagonals of a rhombus are equal in length, while the diagonals of a kite are not. In summary, kites and rhombuses are two distinct shapes with different properties. While they may look similar, their symmetry, angels, and diagonals set them apart. Knowing the differences between these two shapes can be helpful in geometry problems and can also give you a greater appreciation for the intricacies of geometry. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe.